Welcome to my channel Tudos Learning. In today's video, we are going to learn about physical properties of glass, various types of glass, and its various uses. First, physical property of glass will be the refraction, reflection, and transmission of light, which follows the ge geometrical optics. Glass can uh, second property is glass can be poured, formed, extruded, and molded into forms ranging from flat sheets to highly intricate shapes. Glass is also brittle and will fracture unless laminated or tempered to enhance durability. Glass is typically inert resistance to chemical attack and can mostly withstand the action of water. Density of glass varies with chemical composition. Glass is also stronger than most metals. Now we are going to learn is about the various types of glass. There, are, there is quartz, there is soda lime glasses, there is borosilicate glass. There is also lead glass, alumino silicate glass, fiberglass, silica free glasses, bulk metallic glasses and polymer glasses. This was all the ty various types of glasses. Next is the glass production process. How glass is produced. Following the glass batch preparation and mixing, the raw materials are transported to the furnace. Soda lime glass for mass production is melted in gas fired units. After melting, homogenization and refining, the glass is formed. Flat glass for windows and similar applications is formed by the float glass process, which was developed between 1953 and 1957 by the Sir Alastair Pallington and Kenneth Baker staff of the UK Pallington's brothers. Container glass for common bottles and jars is formed by blowing and pressing methods. This glass is often slightly modified chemically for greater water resistance. The glass homogeneity is achieved by homogenizing the raw materials mixture, by stirring the melt and by crushing and remelting the first melt. The obtained glass is usually annealed to prevent breakage during processing. Now we are going to learn about glass coloring. Color in glass may be obtained by addition of homogeneously distributed electrically charged ions. While ordinary soda lime glass appears colorless in thin section, iron oxide impurities produce a green tint in thick sections. A glass melt can also acquire color from a reducing combustion atmosphere. Next is various uses of glass. Glass is a very useful substance and it has many uses such as Glass is typical soda lime sheet glass is typically used as transparent glazing material typically as windows in external walls of buildings. Glass is an essential component of tableware and is typically used for water, beer and wine drinking glasses. The glass is widely used for food and drinking packaging as glass bottles and jars. Glass can be used as substrate in the manufacture of integrated passive devices thin film bulk accusatic resonators and as a hermetic resealing material in device packaging. Glass is an important material in scientific laboratories for the manufacture of experimental apparatus. Glass is a ubiquitous material in optics by virtue of its ability to diffract, reflect and transmit light. Glass as art dates back to at least 1300 BC shown as an example of natural glass found in Tutankhamun's pectora. This is it for today's video. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like, share and comment. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe.